ladies and gents, I am the Rev. Welcome on back to the Beginner's Guide for Osiris New Dawn. And today we're doing vehicles. All the vehicles. Yep, I made them all for you. We've got our hover bike. The Mecha Crab. Spaceship. Rover. The Mech. And the Gav, also known as the Buggy. And come in here real quick. And that is what you need to make the spaceship. And if you look in the previous episode, you see I show you guys how to take off, how to fly, how to land, all of that for the spaceship. That is the mech, which is surprisingly easy, but you got to get them diamonds. And you need diamonds for most of these. The rover. The buggy. The hover bike. And the one I've had the most requests for, the mecha crab. It is working in the main branch. So, what would I make first? First things first, I would always make the hover bike. If you've got diamonds here, if you don't, and you need to go to Lun Lunari, which is what we did in the last episode, then I'd make your spaceship first. One of the two. This by far has the best mobility. See this hill right here? Woo! Nothing else moves as fast as this. This is our speed demon. And it works well on everything. Uh oh, I need to repair it. Um, doesn't work real well on Ezreal. A couple of videos back when I first introduced that and they put the planet back in. Man, I beat the hell out of this thing. But again, it is. Our speed demon. Yeah, you can tell I've been using it. Gotta make sure we get enough stuff for our next one here. All right, up next. You got a choice between two, the rover or the grab. We'll do the rover real quick. Now the rover, important thing about this bad boy is there it is the inventory you can see 24 slots takes hydrazine just like the speed bike and that looks like this and you make it in your chem station takes nitrogen hydrogen and a glass container Come on, let me on. There we go. You can see, you can see us in there. What's up, dude? And this does okay. You're not going to be taking huge hills on this one. I would say medium terrain is what this is best for. So it's good for this planet. Um, would be okay on the moon, but the devs need to definite. Oh, look at that. I'm stuck on a rock. Well. There we go. We can see the problems. We have got our little buggy here. Now, this thing does a little better on terrain, but it's got a mounted gun. The other two vehicles haven't. Neither does the spaceship. Doesn't have a boost. This is as fast as you go. And it'll crap out on you. But it has two for inventory. And you can mine with it. It seems to be some of the fun. Now this will work real well if you're like you've, you're guarding a buddy, right? While they're mining, you're helping them. You guys are keeping your eyes open. For each other. So not a bad vehicle. Again, works real well on Lunari, low gravity. But again, these the one thing the vehicles lack is a sense of weight and momentum. But... Then we get in to the fun. So this one, inventory again, two. Same thing for this one. Whoop. See, two and two.
Do-do. Now mobility wise. You can see it does okay. It looks like medium terrain is it's good with. Uh, you don't get damaged while using it. Using it, you can be hurt in the glider or the hover hovercraft. Now, can we push this off of here? Oh, we can. So there you go. An additional use. And let's go have go kill us some bugs. Because that's what you're going to be getting this for. Again, great thing to uh, you know, pop in on this here. This crater. Normally they do. There he is. Um, you know, while one of your guys is getting gas or whatever. Want some of this? yoo -hoo. Nope, guess not. So they don't have the detection system on the mechs yet. But it's all good. You can speed, kind of. That's the run. That is the jump. And now for the fun one. The Mecha Crab. One thing I probably haven't shown that much, just because it's, you know, I'm just as good with a rifle as I am with this thing. Because that's what this thing is for, is combat. You can handle just about all the terrain. Which you would think it walks on spikes. That's its top speed. That's its normal speed. It has a little bit of a jump to it. We. Alright, normally there's one of those dudes running around. There he is. Hey. Want some of this? Some of these guys today, they're not trying to fight me. Weird. Here we go. Hi. Ooh, he hurt me. Run right on. Good. You are nothing compared to the power of my try shot. But again, it does pretty well. This I probably think would be the best to use on Ezreal just because of the uh, continual stepping stone effect that they have with the landscape there. And also, mine, you can do that in all the various vehicles that have weapons, which is cool. So that's it, folks. That's all the vehicles they currently have. Pretty short one. Not a lot to show you guys. Basically just the stuff, you know, our... Uh... Oop. God, that thing just looks horrid. So tune in for the next episode. As always, keep your heads down. Your guns. And I'll see you again real damn soon.